So you just mentioned then, in, in a very humbling way, about um, you know writing these stories and people's stories, and the bit that actually you you took away pride in was seeing your name attached to the story. Are you able to just tell me a bit about the psychology around that for you, or is it less about the mind and more about the heart? I would say it was it was very much about the heart because when your story makes its imprint into a newspaper that's read by the community or the business sector that means such a lot because that's that's my work that's my craft mm -hmm. and yes there is a recognition to that um, but also in journalist circles getting the byline getting the front page lead that is part of the buzz of the job and interestingly when I worked for the newspaper in West Yorkshire which was a weekly the owner of that newspaper was very reluctant to give bylines you had to work so so hard and prove that you had personally identified found created and submitted that story before you would get a byline so it became a bit of a competition amongst the journalists as to who could get the bylines because they were so infrequently given. So as punishing as that felt at the time, because you had to really work for it, it actually created quite the work ethic in terms of really trying to find a story that was worthy of the byline. And also I'm guessing the feeling of how earned having your name go under that piece of writing. You. Yes. I mean, you knew you earned it. And so now I can, I understand that sense of pride in having your name in there. Yes. 